Hi everyone, it's Robin. Welcome back to my channel. Um, so I am doing a favorites video today. It's been a hot minute since I've done one. And, um, you know, I know a lot of people have their acts together. I am not one of those people and they manage to get to these monthly and I bow down in humble um, servitude to those people. I, I don't even know how they get, I mean, I can't, um, but I can barely get my kids fed at night, so whatever. Uh, so yeah, don't, don't use me as a barometer of, you know, no. So anyway, um, I, the kind of the mood struck, I realized that I had a lot of items that I was reaching for or using on a really regular basis over the last probably month or so. And so I'm just going to do a random, like, current favorites video. So um, rather than like just throw a whole ton of stuff at you guys, um, I tried to pick something from each category. I picked like a piece of jewelry, something from the handbag world, like a makeup item and a skincare item. So I'm gonna start with um, the jewelry or accessory. And I featured this, gosh, it's been several weeks now on um, my Instagram. I was sent this by a subscriber who has a boutique here in London called Six for Gold Boutique. Six for Gold Boutique. And they stock um, absolutely beautiful jewelry that and accessories and things like that that um, are actually hard to find here in the UK. A lot of them are US designers and things like that. There are, I believe, some UK designers, but um, some of them are like smaller indie brands that are impossible to get outside of you know the country where they're from. And so she approached me and she said, and really quick, before I even go into this, this is not a sponsored or an ad video. I am not being monetarily compensated for any of this. Um, Brenda approached me and she said, hey Robin, you know, um, I like your videos, I, you know, I like your Instagram, and your style, your casual style, seems to be the kind of style that sort of would, would find things that they would enjoy, you know, that you could find something that you enjoy in my boutique. Would you like to have a look and see if it appeals? And so I did, I had a look and there were several items that I really liked, and um, she said, okay, I would like to gift you an item of your choice and if you receive it and it is something that you enjoy, if you would just let your subscribers, because a lot of people that follow you have the same aesthetic as you, um, it would just be a good way for me to get my name out there. And I, and I really thought about it for a couple of days. I, I mean, <laughs> you can message her and ask her. I went radio silent for like four days, four or five days while I was thinking about it because I'm not going to be that person. I'm not, that, I'm not a professional YouTuber, but I'm certainly not in the business of selling my integrity or my, um, or my opinion. I have been approached by sunglass companies. I have been approached by, um, like, what are they, the earbud? and I'm not interested. So this is the first time that I've been approached though, that I saw a product that I thought, you know what, I would actually buy that for myself. And so I said, you know, I like this piece, which was this right here. And I said, however, here's, here's how I'll approach it. I will only, only if I receive it, and it is something that I would gift to a friend or buy for myself, will I talk about it, review it, post about it. If not, I'll just package it back up, send it back to you, and we shall never speak of it again. And she said, deal. And we didn't go into this with like a contract. It was just like, you know, it might make it into a video. I'll post about it when I get to it. And it was just like, you know what, Robin, if the spirit moves you, absolutely. Um, so this is what I chose. This is the beautiful Persian turquoise Illume bangle. Let me make sure I have that. Persian turquoise Illume bangle. Yes. And you can see that it's sort of an antiqued gold. It's, um, I mean, it's shiny, but it's like a, um, like a dull shiny, if that makes sense. You can kind of, I mean, you can see that it's shiny, but it's almost like, um, like a rubbed effect. I'm not a jeweler, so I am, I am like guessing. Um, it, you can just slip it off like that, I want you guys to see it up close. So it has beautiful crystals. Um, they are like a gunmetal. I'm trying to get a, a really good up close. They're a gunmetal, and then they've got like a like a burnished gold row around that Persian turquoise 
sort of center, almost like a, um, almost reminds me of a peacock feather. Um, and I just, I love it. I received it and uh, I put it on and at first I was like, yeah, yeah, it's really pretty. And then I realized I can work this into just about any outfit. Now that it helps that I dress in a very um, muted color tone, you know, palette, pa color palette. You know, I don't wear a lot of crazy colors, but this looks amazing with my, um, with my taupe Birkin. And it's just, it just, it looks great with everything that I put with it. And I, sorry, <laughs> I closed it. I just, I love it. I just, I think it looks so nice. It looks absolutely beautiful with my Cartier um, Love Bangle. And it's casual and it's easy and it makes a beautiful stack and I love it. And um, as a special sort of little thing, gesture for my subscribers, I hate that word, but for you guys who are watching and for those who are on Instagram, Brenda has offered an exclusive code for those of you who would like to go and pick up this or something else on um, the site. It's a site-wide code for 15% off. Um, your code will be Robin15, R-O-B-Y-N. Make sure that there's a Y, not an I. Robin, R-O-B-Y-N, and the number 15. And that will entitle you to 15% off um, site-wide. And, um, yeah, and I can highly, I can just, I can give all of my confidence that like the customer service is fantastic. It shipped quickly, it shipped securely, and I am almost positive that she offers free shipping on the items on the site. So um, I will put a link below to this uh, so that you can check it out yourself. There's also a matching, like a matching ring. I know my friend bought the matching ring and it's just, it's absolutely beautiful. But there are several other of these, um, there's a navy blue one. I, is it navy? It's like a blue um, that I am eyeballing because I want it. So anyway, <laughs> so that's my one of my favorites this month and I'm loving that. Okay, next item. This is, uh, I did a reveal recently on this. This is the little Chanel coin purse and um, it holds, I emptied it yesterday so that I could do this video, but it holds cards, coins, and cash and it's just great. It fits in my jumbo, keeps it from getting too heavy, and it also leaves me plenty of room for other items like sunglasses and, you know, the little makeup bag. I use a mini pochette for that. So this has been absolutely fantastic. Like I said, there's a, a video on it. Oh my gosh, look at that shine. Like, oh, ding. Um, and there's a video on this, the, the unboxing, and I go into everything in terms of um, pricing and all that stuff. But this has been fantastic. Um, Beauty item, the skincare. This is the Hydra or Hydra Beauty Serum by Chanel. It is hydration, protection, and radiance. Okay, when you get to a certain age, holla, um, radiance is hard to come by because, oh my gosh, look at this, sorry. Um, radiance is hard to come by, especially for somebody with rosacea, has sensitive skin. Um, I can't use a lot of chemicals and things on my skin to exfoliate and that sort of thing. So something like this, that will bring back like the luminosity is just absolutely fantastic and well i would pay twice what i paid for it <laughs> this is the 1.7 ounce it's the big one i saw this on caroline hirons um either her in i think it was instagram but it might have been um one of her videos but absolutely loving this my only gripe about it and about a lot of chanel products is um it's fragranced and i don't really like the fragrance like it's not a nice fragrance to me, but it's it's not terrible and it goes away and I cover it up with something else like oils and stuff anyway. So um, that's definitely a must for me. And then the last item, and I apologize in advance to all of my non-US watchers um, because I do not think this is easily available outside of the, I'm trying to get all the, the powder, outside of the US, but this is the Tarte, oh God, sorry guys, the Tartlet in Bloom um, Eyeshadow Palette by Tarte. And um, it's just, I'm using it today. Today on my eyes, ooh, kind of a mess. Today on my eyes, I have um, this one, which is Rebel, and this one up, where is it? <laughs> that one right there, which is Jet Setter. And then I've got a little bit of Funny Girl, sort of like on the lid to kind of give a little bit of brightness. Um, it has a nice, I'm trying to sort of, has a nice big mirror. So this is actually a great, uh, palette for travel because also you can see that it's got these really dark shades and they work beautifully to line um, and I've even seen somebody used this color right here smarty pants 
which looks really orange there, but it's not, to like contour her face. And so, um, I don't know that you could use anything for blush, but it's a, it's a pretty, um, pretty comprehensive little palette and it's not overly big to give you an idea. It's pretty narrow. So for size reference, it's great for travel. You could easily take something like this on um, a holiday, like a two week holiday and you'd be absolutely fine. You don't need much more than that because it's got all of your neutrals, but then, um, you know, it's got a nice highlight shade and then it does have these three right here that you can create a wicked smoky eye with. So those are my favorites for today. Um, yeah, or not for today, but my current favorites, things that I've been really enjoying lately. Um, if you have any questions, leave them down below. And on that note, questions and comments and things like that, it's starting to get overwhelming. I have reached a subscriber number um, that I never anticipated. Um, it's, <laughs> it's astounding, but I am struggling to keep up. Um, I used to put aside about a half hour to 45 minutes a day to sort of maintain um, an answer because I, I felt strongly and I still do feel strongly that if you take the time to comment, I want to take the time to acknowledge that comment, but it's getting, it's getting to, not only is it getting to be impossible, it's causing me serious amounts of stress because I have comments that are sitting there that have been sitting there for weeks and I can't get to them because I don't always have an hour to sit down and do them. And it's really hard to go in, answer a few, and then come back because I have to find where I was. And so moving forward, I do my, I read them all. I read them all. I have to stress that, that I read your comments. And if you're saying something like, oh, you look nice today or whatever, I do my best to say thank you. I always, as best I can, answer the questions, but I, I can't always get to them. So I apologize. I also suck at the PM function. Um, and I, I suck at the PMs. If you really truly need to PM me, PM me on Instagram, it's easier because I actually get an alert. I don't get an alert on YouTube. If I'm missing something, somebody needs to share where that is because I don't know where it is. Um, so I apologize that I have let the that part of YouTube sort of fall by the wayside. It's not because I don't love you guys. It's not because I don't appreciate the comments. I cannot stress enough that it is not because I am too big for my britches or don't have time for you guys. It's that I don't have time. I, you know, I guess it's not that I don't have time for you guys. I just don't have time. I want to have time. So I know that probably sounds like a contradiction. I have time for you guys. I just don't have time to, to go through each individual and say, thank you. 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 Um, for the, the, the comments that don't truly need a response like a, Hey, and I'm going to do a video by the way, on my eyeglasses, on my, my Tom Ford eyeglasses. Cause you all are interested. <laughs> so those are going to get their own little video soon. It's going to be like a three minute video, but I'm going to do it. Um, the reason I don't generally is because I, I wear them and I need them. And then I have contacts in today and you'd think I would do it today. Maybe I'll run upstairs and get them and do it really quick. I'm mumbling because that's what I do. Um, and some of you guys are like, you know what, if you stopped mumbling and answered some, uh, comments. Yeah. Anyway, that's me. That's today. Um, you guys take care. I'm going to try and film you know what? This is going to be it for a while because I have dental surgery tomorrow and my kids are on holiday for two solid weeks. So unless they leave the house, I, I don't film with people in the house. So that's that. Um, you guys take care and I will talk to you guys all soon. Bye.